Till now, I, I hope this was a nightmare. Now I know it isn't. Think of it as a dream from which you will never awaken. Barnabas, let, let me talk to him. Maybe I can convince him to cooperate. No, no, but never. You've got to, to save yourself. That's not my idea of being saved, Julia. No. But I don't think we need to discuss it any further. <laughs> what are you planning to do? I plan to do nothing. What? The eminent Dr. Hoffman will take care of everything. Julia. given us no alternative. For a moment, I was afraid I had. What do you mean? Death wasn't my worst fear. I asked you what you meant. Barnabas, please, please let me try to talk to him. He again. has a question to answer. I prefer death to... To what? Say it. You know to what? Say it. I dare you. Barnabas, don't. To being something like you are. Something loathsome and evil. Tell me more. Something inhuman and Go on. human form. Go on. I prefer anything rather than becoming the undead. Really? I only, my only regret, Barnabas, is that I won't live to be able to destroy you. I see. So you read the notes. Then you realize I have the power to turn you into something not unlike myself. Barnabas. If my experiments are successful, we can undo all the harm. No, please, Julia. But that way, he wouldn't have to kill you. I don't want to live if it has to be that way. Please don't let him kill you. Barnabas, if you make me into something like yourself, I, I swear I'll find a way to destroy myself. But first, I'll find out a way to let people know what you are. Do you believe that your free will will remain after my little treatment? Yes, enough of it will remain. Enough of yours remains. If you chose Barnabas, you, you could destroy yourself. You certainly could turn yourself in. Never. No, of course you won't. But you could, and I would. Witness, Doctor, I tried to save him. Proceed. You don't have to hold me. I, I know I can't escape. I won't let you try. We want a minimum of clutter. I don't want the room strewn with broken objects. Barnabas, I'm not going to struggle. Death is undignified enough without my making it worse. Dave, isn't there anything I can say to him? <laughs> is there anything I can say to you? Well, whatever he says, I'll never trust him now. Proceed. You uh, did bring the hypodermic with you, didn't you? Yes. Then I turn the patient over to you, doctor. Don't call me that. Not now. Dr. Hoffman, one of the brightest and I thought bravest doctors I've ever known. Oh, don't. So much, so much good you could have done. The lives you could have saved, Julia. Stop. The suffering you could have helped. Please. You have the means to stop him. How am I to die? A perfectly natural death for a healthy man in the prime of life, a heart attack. Julia. I'm waiting. I, I, I can't. You no longer have a choice. I can't. You have to. He's, he's my friend. You no longer have friends. He's right. You no longer have any friends, Julia. I, I can't do it. Then I'll do it myself. No. Give it to me. No, I can't let you. I said give it to me. A little knowledge is a dangerous thing, but a lot of knowledge is even more dangerous. Sarah. Sarah. 
Where? I don't know. I don't know. There. There. Sir. Stop him! Is she here? No. No one is here. You dare mention her name to me. Loathsome I am and evil. You can mock me for that. But leave my pain alone. No. Tell me he's dead. He's dead. He's dead. 